Hey guys, welcome to the vault. We are back with some more exclusive content. Jason, Leon, and Pierre here. We're joined by <coughs> Ariel, the Snapback God. Bless you, Jason, and uh, Hezzy. Um, we're here to give you guys another episode of Views Genuine Draft with a twist. Hope you guys enjoy. Pierre, take it away. Man, this this time, this time around, we're gonna build the perfect Christmas. We're gonna have traditions, right? Mm-hmm. Decorations, mm-hmm. food. Mm-hmm. Song mm-hmm. and a movie. Yep. Are you ready for this snapback? You're looking really close at the screen. Oh, I'm, I'm very ready, and I, I like how the party just keeps getting bigger and bigger. <laughs> <laughs> it's like we got to well, dig deep. Yeah, we got to dig deep, but we also wanted to give you an opportunity to finally win one of these things. <sighs> so we had to water down the product. Yeah, not so, today. Just yeah, not as today. a re- just as a recap, right? Uh, let's just throw it out there, like. You created Paw Patrol. <laughs> you created you created a poor excuse for David Copperfield. Okay, okay. <laughs> and you Magic. eked out you eked out um, top three in the pet peeves. Now, listen. A lot of people were loving my my choices for the superhero. They said, "Snap, you got a, you got a fucking superhero, bro." The and old, I said, the I'm old... to tell those guys. <laughs> The only person that the only comment that I saw said that was from a person named the Snapback Guy. <laughs> <laughs> and that person was like, "I like my powers." <laughs> yeah, yeah. I, I I don't know. So we want to. I, I think that I think if I had to put my money on someone today, it's you, Snap. There it is. Why? Mm-hmm. I'm trying to get a little confidence here, man, because I'm kind of getting sick of kicking the puppy. <laughs> you know what I mean? I want I want you to step up to the plate today and I want you to do us proud. Now, your first mission though is to spin this wheel, right? You're gonna tell us who's going first? Yeah, here we go. Let's uh last. It. Who's going who's gonna pick last or first? Let's do first. first. Let's do first this time. Yeah, yeah, tradition first. category. All right. First person. The first person that said it, Jason. What is that noise? People apl- applauding that Jason. <laughs> Second person. Oh yes, snap. Yes. Yes. Uh, finally, finally. We're all gonna rotate though. Yeah. Yeah, we're gonna rotate. Yeah. Yeah. But second is good. Pierre in third. What's going on? What's going on? And fourth. Hezzy in fourth, Leon. Okay, there we go. So that means that I pick first on the next round. Yes. And then Pierre picks first in the following round, like that. Okay. Yes. Yeah. All right. Cool beans. All right. So leading it off, um, we're going to have Jason draft decoration, right? Oh, decoration? Decoration is the first one. Yeah, the first category. Decoration. Oh, first pick fine. goes to you, Jason. And are you going to veto what we originally talked about? Yeah. No, no. There's no, there's no exclusion. No veto? Okay. No exclusions? No exclusions. No exclusions. Well, I mean, fuck. I'm kind of <laughs> stuck with this first pick, right? For decoration? Yeah. I got to go with the fucking Christmas tree. <sighs> I mean, right. it, it's not Christmas without the tree. Okay. <laughs> that's scribbling. It is Christmas yeah, that's, the only, that's the only one I had. <laughs> right, it's coming with a whole tree. All right, you're up, Snap. All right, I'm gonna go with the next best thing: presents. You got to decorate the room with presents. All right. Mm. Uh, that's not a decoration. That's. I mean, huh? we'll let him pick. We'll let him pick it because it's a shitty ass pick. Like, it's not a <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't even fit in this category, but you don't you decorate to... with presents. Like, yeah, right, you, man. The, the, the boxes are a part. The boxes are a part of the whole thing. I was the cheering Christmas, for you, Snap. Christmas boxes. Yeah. We're really. You, you had the second pick. I was cheering for you. <laughs> presents I, I is great decoration. I'm taking back. I'm taking back who I put my money on. <laughs> <laughs> like if if someone's like, hey, you know, like. You know what's the favorite Christmas decoration, and you come out with presents. 
<laughs> so that's not okay. So we're not counting as decor. Okay, I'll change my vote. No, you can't. No. You mm-hmm. pick presents. Mm-hmm. No, because you guys are not counting that as a decoration. No, no, we're just saying it's a shitty pick. That's all. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> we can't count presents as a decoration. No, you can. You can. You, you can. Did. Can. You okay, can. fine. I had it on my list. I, mean, I got a whole crowd of people that are going to touch this. Very far down on my <laughs> list, but I had it on my list. <laughs> I wouldn't have picked the second, but you know. <laughs> All right. I, uh, who's I, up? I, I, Here? Did he actually pick that though? Yeah, yeah he, he picked, picked presents. presents. Are you are you gonna are you, so you guys are gonna allow me to pick presents? Yes or no? Yeah. <laughs> you pick yeah. presents. Yeah. Do you want yeah. do you want to keep it at presents? Well no. We're not have you it. ever celebrated <laughs> have you ever celebrated Christmas snap? <laughs> yeah, tons of time. The presents are the best part of the whole Christmas. <laughs> right. All right, All right. Fine. decoration. Uh, I'll take pre- that's not a decoration. I'll take no, no, you I'll, take it, back. No. I'll take it back. I'll take it back. I'll take it back. You can't change the pick. That's what you pick. Because you Christmas pick. boxes, Christmas it. box. Okay, Christmas box. You essentially Christmas pick garbage. Box. You have to wrap. You have to. You the no. All right, listen. Presents. The reason you pick presents, Pierre. Okay, presents. Your choice. There it is. I'm going with something that's tried and true. I mean, I used to love. Digging my little paws into it, the Christmas stocking. Okay, okay. that's it. I'll yeah. give you that one. I mean, a fireplace doesn't look right at Christmas time. Though. No, no, but but listen, I, I can understand why someone would go um, presents or Christmas <laughs> box. No, no, you can't. <laughs> I've never seen so like so. I just got to understand this. So, snap, do you go to the store and buy a bunch of like. Just like empty gift boxes, and that's what you decorate with. <laughs> that's also yeah. sad, man. Listen, if they're making a Christmas set on Hollywood, those things are not stuff with actual presents. They're they're actual just empty boxes that they gift. Wow. Right? No, I I get that, I get that, but no. This isn't is, perfect. But this isn't building the perfect holiday, um, yeah. uh, holiday movie this set. This is Hollywood. <laughs> this is like like in your cozy home, like how you, you know what decoration. Well, it, when we throw big party, when we throw big parties at my house, my mom used to put along with the real presents, other fake presents to make it look very grand. Yeah. Oh, uh, okay. You okay. know what? Snaps, okay. Since you're my uh, enemy today, I fully respect your. Your decision. That's a good choice. Man. That's a very good choice. I was on board to let you pick again, but <laughs> yeah, no, guys no, there's these guys. There's no, win. no, there's no repicking. You draft I'm, what you draft. I'm fine with that. Yeah, if I'm fine with that. It's shitty. It's shitty, and, okay, and, it, and yeah. most of most of snaps are shitty. So <laughs> he doesn't get a repick. Okay, <laughs> go ahead. All right, All right fellas. My favorite time of year, Christmas. So this is this is my video. Since Jason picked Christmas tree, doesn't feel like Christmas without hanging up the Christmas lights. Brian's up a house, Brian's up a room, makes it fill you all with jitters and joy and happiness mm-hmm. and yeah. all that. It gives me it gives me fucking vertigo. That too. That too. Getting up on that ladder every single year to hang those stupid fucking lights. It's, that's it's why, by far the worst as a homeowner. It's the worst decoration. That's why time. you leave. That's why you leave them on all year long, Jason. What, no, no, we don't. Come on, Hez, Hezzy, that might work. Hezzy, you do look like the type that have a house with Christmas lights in that July. Might work, yeah. That might work. That might work in the trailer. That might work in the trailer park. It does not work here. <laughs> I do. Hezzy yeah. looks like the kind of guy that's gonna have Christmas lights <laughs> in a little kitty, fucking, little plastic <laughs> kitty pool out in the front lawn. Everybody, the home association has fined them up to like yeah. Um, yeah. Hey, hey, I do it <laughs> once. I do. Down? I do it once a year, fellas. That's all I'm doing, and that's it. That is it. All right. Light lights are good. Lights are good. Just as a, as somebody that has to hang them up, they're paying the fucking. Paying yeah. Yes. Yeah. They're cool to look at. All right. Mm-hmm. So my decoration wasn't something that was really um, around when I was a kid, but I have a lot of friends with like smaller children. I think this is a really cool decoration. You get to change it every day leading up to Christmas. It's the elf on the shelf. Enjoyable by all. Um, parents it's get not- to, you know, think of different ways to um, move that the elf. What? And then the, the kids get to uh, figure out a new way to. I used to use it to scare my kids. Yeah, I know. That's mm. why it's it's hilarious on both ends. So I'll I, was, I One of my favorite things to do with it was to put it sitting up on their dresser. 
would have a flashlight facing up at its face. <laughs> snap, snap. It's it's like a it's a, a little elf that um the parents pretend like it's it comes out. No, uh, no, like, the elf reports the elf back moves. to Santa Claus every night, flies back to the North Pole, and then in the morning it's in a different spot in your house. Yeah. You've never actually read watch, the packaging. To watch uh to watch the kids to make sure they're they're being good and it flies I'll back tell you right now Spanish people night. don't mess with the elf. Thank you. Because my parents uh, used to scare me too. So that's why I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, no, I I I I'm telling you, I used to face the flashlight up at its head, so it would look like a horror scene. Yeah. Oh wow. Yeah, after, hated that after about 20 years of that thing, it gets real fucking old real quick. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah, but if your kids are still being fooled by it at 20. Well, no, no. I mean, this is several, several yeah. kids. Yeah. Leon, you before, right? you made fun of my pick, so I'm about to destroy your pick. You just did like some kind of new porno Christmas with this little elf. <laughs> porno Christmas. <laughs> okay, you keep going with these perverted picks, and it, and it keeps continuing on. And now you got this little creepy elf that. Goes- you know what? You know what, Ariel? Yeah. You have, you have the first pick in the next. Um, category, which happens to be All tradition, right. which would have been a great time to pick presents, but <laughs> we'll see what you're going to do about that. <laughs> I mean, you still can. How about <laughs> opening the presents? Is that your pick? Is that your pick? Yes. Spanish people, right. we celebrated at midnight on the tw- so on the 24th, we all gathered together. At midnight, we that's opened the, the presents. We wait till the that's, morning. Now, that's now we the 25th. <laughs> Midnight is now. So I, I hate to break it to you. Yeah, but once it hits midnight, yeah. I'm. But yeah. Americans usually go to sleep and then wake up and open up. Yeah, the because you gotta wait for Santa Claus to come. We do it where at do midnight. All the, where do all the midnight. presents come from? Well, my my parents they they told me straight up from the beginning. They was like, "Listen, <laughs> we bought all this. It's Santa Claus." Wow, Santa works wow. a day early for that's, for us. That's that says a lot, actually. That, that's oh. a wow. All right. Opening presents is a good one. I mean, that's mm. that's pretty much the whole point of the season. That's a good pick, man. That's a that's a power pick. Yeah. That's I a know. like pound your chest. I'm in charge right now, <laughs> pick. <laughs> right, now, right? Pierre. Well, now we're on to Pierre, right? All right. Eating. Sure. That's the second best. Yeah. I mean, we all, we, we all put on 20, yeah. pounds. We all put on 20, 20 pounds in, in December. That's a very simple – listen, you, you may you may scoff at that pick, right? But that's oh, another no. power pick. Yeah. That is one that's just to the point, eating. Eating. That's what we do yeah, all eating. December long. And why the gym yeah, don't act like you're surprised time. by eating? Like <laughs> I would have been, I would have been more specific. He, like, is, there Chris, is there a typical Christmas? Is a typical meal that you're eating in Christmas? Well, that's gonna be covered in the food category. Right? We're gonna talk yeah, about yeah, food yeah. later, but the oh, biggest yeah, tradition yeah. for me, like besides opening presents, is it's not even about what. It's just eating. Yeah, yeah the dinner. Yeah, the dinner. Pies, foods like mashed potato, Treat, Christmas treats all fucking month long, all like, day long. My mom's mm-hmm. putting food out. My mom's putting food yeah. out. Putting food out. That's a big Hezzy, tradition, man. I mean, obviously, has he looks like he doesn't know what food is. I don't. Leon, I just, and Leon, Leon's quite the opposite. Leon looks like he <laughs> understands exactly what I'm talking about. Oh yeah. yeah. I just go there for the presents, fellas, not the food. Mm-hmm. Well, right. well, if you're going to Snap's house, you got to be careful what you open because a lot of them are going to be empty boxes that are used for decoration. <laughs> you yeah. might get a whammy. <laughs> All right, All right. right. who's up next? Hezzy. All right, so this tradition is mainly for the young, the young bucks or the people that have young bucks. My tradition is leaving cookies for Santa. On Christmas Eve night. Oh, well, that's a good one, man. Thank you. Thank you. Yep. Very really creative. Thank you. Thank you. Very really creative. Because we all did it. Let's face yep. it. We all did we it. We still do it. We still do it. We still wait for Santa. Come on now. Yeah, them, them cookies was gone in my house. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Wait, 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 wait. I got a question, though. Mm. And this is I, I, just so for my understanding. If if Santa doesn't come and you open all your presents at midnight, 
who 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 are you setting the cookies out for? Well, I wasn't. We wasn't. As I was saying, we wasn't setting out the cookies. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Okay. At, at midnight, we, we focus on gifts. Straight gifts. Right. We didn't care about cookies, milk. So no midnight. No midnight. Oh, oh Hezzy, that doesn't make sense, Hezzy. If yeah. you open up the presents at midnight, then what were you doing with the cookies? Right. Look. Who were you okay. Look. The cookies out for. Look. 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 There was a certain time where I learned that Santa, you know. I'm not going to spoil it because maybe people. I hear a know. child. I hear a child in someone's background. <laughs> That's got to be Snap. Yeah, she, she might like hear. 15 of them around. So, like. yeah, I learned at a certain time that Santa. <laughs> Let me mix this. So, I that's when I. Because she heard Snap say there's no such thing as Santa Claus. <laughs> Put your headphones on, like, Snap. <laughs> like, Mommy, let's go stab Daddy. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I, I was just I was just curious how the timeline plays out. Like, if, if you don't go to bed waiting for Santa Claus, who are you setting the cookies out for? That's all. Mm. All right. Well, well, I remember back in Venezuela, they would make us go into a room and we would wait. A certain, we would give Santa like a certain time, and then he oh, would, okay. He would so you had, you had to schedule your time with Santa Claus. Yeah, yeah. Oh, was, got it. Got it. Interesting. Interesting. He had an itinerary. Got it. <laughs> All right. So my pick for tradition. There's nothing like it to me, like a good old Kris Kringle. So that's going to either a work function or even a friend's party. You're bringing a random gift, put it in the middle, and you draft an order. And you can do steals if you want, depending on house rules it's or whatever. White elephant. You guys call it white elephant. Mm-hmm. That okay. sounds like a key part. I thought it was a mystery Santa. <laughs> I see, I see. I it was the secret Santa is different. Like you, you select someone a, and you're giving them there, a gift. It sounds like some weird prostitution ring. <laughs> is there is there a fishbowl involved? A fishbowl? Well, the, to draw the order. And then uh-huh. you can only so steal it so many times. And then if you steal bowl? it, you got to do a drink. Yeah. Oh, okay. So you're, all right, all right. So his, I really tradition, you know. his, his Christmas so, tradition is a swinger party. Got it. <laughs> I thought he was doing something with a mistletoe. I swear to God, I could have thought. <laughs> Chris Kringle, you guys call it white elephant? Whatever. Yeah, yeah, that's white elephant. Yeah. Oh, okay. I was gonna say, what the heck is? Pringle? That is what it's called. It's called a white elephant here. Yeah. I was gonna say, well, I thought Leon was talking about Pringles. I was like, what? The hell is that? I thought he was talking about some sort of food or something. I don't know. No, no, we'll right. cover that next. All right. Uh, let's see. Um. There's a couple of good traditions left. I'm going to go uh, taking the kids to go see Santa Claus, either at the mall uh. or or wherever, to, so they can give him their list um, yeah. for Christmas morning. Tradition slash torture. Torture. Like torture. torture, yeah. yeah. There's nothing like, torture. like sitting on an old drunk man's lap. In in public and 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 uh, telling them your secrets. So yeah, yeah. that's my favorite Christmas question. <laughs> someday after someday <laughs> after you got Leon sixty years in the pen. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Tells so me they don't vi- hire vis- a lot of... visiting visiting Santa Claus is my is my pick. Something tells you don't hire a lot of Chinese Santas. <laughs> Why not? I'm not I'm not in charge of that. Leon, you would be a perfect Santa Claus. Yeah. Eh, I don't know about perfect, but. Oh no, you would be. <laughs> you would be. I'm missing my calling then. But all right. Everyone picked, right? Yep. Yeah. All right. So the next category, Pierre goes first, and it's gonna be food, Christmas food. Any type of food item. All right. There could be any kind of food item, right? Yeah. Anything. Could be drink, food, whatever. Snacks. Candy canes. Okay. Mm. Any particular flavor? Peppermint, the original, the OG. Uh-huh. Okay. You got to say about that, Snap? Yeah, everybody's going to have good breath at the house. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you know, for my pet peeves, that's important. Everybody's yeah, just going to eat peppermints at your big dinner, the main course. <laughs> Yeah, listen. If I had to pick a second, it'd be mashed potatoes. But I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go with the tried and true candy cane. All right, all right. I mean, there's nothing more Christmas about 
than than a candy cane. Mm-hmm. There's really not. I mean, I'm sure you're gonna pick something very interested, like uh, I don't know, bananas. Who me? No. Oh. Map. Yeah. <laughs> well, who's going right. next? Hezzy. Hezzy. Me. Hezzy. Yeah. All right. The famous food that everyone should eat. If you haven't had this, a hot, nice wrapped tamale. <laughs> uh, tamale. Tamale. I don't even think that. I think that's a good pick. Um, My parents order that every Christmas, and I have to order a different meal. I told my parents, like, from now on, don't order my food. I don't want tamales. Give me. I'm going to Longhorns and I'm bringing my own food to Crazy. the dinner. They order tamales every freaking year. You know, I tell my mom, do not order them damn tamales for me. I don't. I'm not gonna eat with y'all. Hey, when I said tamales, snap face just dropped. He's like, oh yeah. Yes, I hate that tamales. Word. Yo, like every freaking year, it was tamales, and I would and I would sit there not eat anything because it was tamales. Mm-hmm. Every time he hits mute, you know his uh his, his one of his children is screaming, <laughs> screaming like, "What do you mean there's no fucking Santa Claus?" <laughs> <laughs> All right, for my food, could easily went with like a like a candy like Pierre or go 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 to a liquid, but I'm a uh, horizontally gifted, so I got to go with the main event, Christmas ham. You do ham? Ham. ham. I took my mm. fucking ham. God. <laughs> ham, ham. Ham, ham. Ham's an Easter thing here. Christmas ham. I thought you would go Christmas goose. Nah. Because you hate those fucking things. So what What better way to get back at them? Than <laughs> well, how are you going to kill them? That's the problem. <laughs> <laughs> right, They're right. not indestructible, Leon. <laughs> They are. They, man. Got, they got a long ass neck. There's there's a big target there. Them Good, point. Good, point, Good point, Leon. Good point. All right, Jay, you're up. Oh, I'm up. Fuck. Um. Oh fuck. Yeah. The cookies. You got, Christmas you got cookies. Sugar, yeah, yeah. Sugar cookies. Your ginger snaps. My grandpa used to make these like from Germany. They're these little tiny sugar like, balls. Um, Sugar no, balls? no, they they got like sugar balls. I don't want to hear what you call Leon late at night. Yeah, <laughs> you, got, you, got, you got your tam- you you you're sitting there slurping on tamale and sugar balls. I'm I'm eating <laughs> fucking cookies here. Uh, but all the Christmas, sugar all the balls. Christmas cookies, sugar balls. Like what? Who they, said they have balls? a they have a name. I don't know. That's your Ball. that's your that what your girl calls you. What? Uh, but... <laughs> How'd you know? Jesus. <laughs> anyway, Christmas cookies. All right. All right, snap. You're up. I'm going to go with a nice, juicy, perfect roast lamb. That's my. Like, <laughs> <laughs> yes. Nice roast lamb. Everybody's. It ain't no pepper bits at my dinner. It ain't no cookies. It ain't no tamales. <laughs> I mean, start on ham. Have- you don't this is to, a uh, this is this is for the whole family. Nice roast lamb, woo juice. Yeah, yes. So you're eating eating fucking uh, Bam, you know Bambi's little friend. Okay, lamb, lamb. I mean, lamb. I love a lamb. Can you read yours? Can you read yours so far? So far out, out loud, staff. I got <laughs> present boxes. <laughs> Opening presents. <laughs> so two of the same. Nice, okay. Juicy roasted premium roast lamb. Like the whole the whole lamb? The whole lamb. The whole lamb for the whole family. Yeah. You yeah, scan yeah, that yeah, out right there. It. Boom. I'm right there on the dinner table. And then they got to go boxes ready to go. There you go. <laughs> so you have to open up day. the fake ones. You can put the lamb in there. <laughs> Well, listen to this. Would you rather eat peppermints or would you rather have a lamb? Don't, That's why I took a meat. That's why I took a meat. Don't don't you take, don't you have a mint sauce with your lamb? You said what else? Well, no, we only can pick one thing. So if we're gonna eat one oh, thing okay. at the house. My choice is the lamb, not the peppermint. Listen, listen. It, it's not about like the only food. No, no. It's just your favorite one. <laughs> 
You think I? You think I pull up to the table? My mom just lays out a bunch of like. Warm, <laughs> okay. You guys, you guys candy. told me last week when I picked flying that I wasn't specific about being able to breathe out of air, like breathe air in space. You hold that. on, hey, you hold on to this stuff for a while, huh? Yeah, he's been waiting. Yeah, he's been waiting. You know, All I, right, at first, as competitive as Snap is at these drafts, you think he'd do a little bit better. <laughs> but anyway, he's not, I, I mean, if he's researching, that's even scarier. If this is what yeah, he comes yeah. up with after researching, right? You you want to see my list for tonight's draft? It's right, it's right there. Okay, Go ahead. completely blank. Door. Completely off blank. All right. Okay. Because I got you on the next two categories. I next all category: good. song and Hezzy goes first. <laughs> this is gonna be something we never heard of. This is easy. I'm no, writing, this, I'm not even this, writing it down. This would be something by Menudo. This is so. <laughs> this, this song got played so much. It became You're gonna take my fucking song. I swear. I am. I am. I'm gonna take everyone's song. It is yeah. Mayara, Mayara Carey. Well, you gotta say her name right first. You gotta say it right though. <laughs> Mayara, Mariah, 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 Mariah Carey. Thank you. Because I don't know who Maria Carey is. Maria <laughs> Carey, Mariah, Mamua. <laughs> Mariah Carey. Mariah. Carey. <laughs> Which song? All I want for Christmas is you. Sugar Ball. Ooh. Anthem on this. My that song. Is, my song is better. I guarantee it. Not even close. Watch. Not even You're close. Yeah. Wait. All right. I'm gonna I go. Mean, that's, a, that's, a, that's like the logical choice. Yeah, but that's that like the like... most annoying Christmas song. Yeah. It's... But this no, that's not a no. That song, I, I I listen to that damn song in the summertime. That's how much I love Mariah's version of the damn song. Now. I listen <laughs> to that song it's a, great, it's, a great, it's a great song. It's, it's a classic. It's, yeah. If it's played in November, I might kill somebody though. Um, but anyway, <laughs> um, my song with the Canadian Goose. For, my uh, song for... has a little bit more repeat factor to me. I'm gonna go Chris Brown's This Christmas. Chris Brown. Chris Brown. Chris Brown. Brown. You want a little side oh, of that Christmas song? <laughs> I mean, artist aside, that is a great Christmas song. You might as well pick one by R. Kelly. <laughs> I mean, it's just one that's at least is repeatable. I mean, nothing so screams Christmas like R. Kelly. I get nah. it. So. <laughs> He's a giver. All right. <laughs> nice choice, Leon. Oh, shit. Um, I'm up, right? Yep. Yes. Yes. Because I went after the ham last time. Um, <clears throat> there's so many bad ones out there. I'm going to go with uh, Wham's Last Christmas. Man. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's what it was about. That's the whitest choice of them all. <laughs> well, for the whitest guy on the panel, it probably makes a lot of sense, huh? <laughs> Who's up next? I don't uh, like Christmas. Songs. It would be Snap. Oh. I'm going to go with Jose Feliciano's. Feliz Navidad. Do, 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 do. Feliz <laughs> Navidad. Do, 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 do. Good. Good. Feliz I, Navidad. I, I, Prospero año. Felicidad. Do, 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 do. I want to wish you a Merry Christmas. I want to wish you a Merry Christmas. I'm going to fix this oh. for you guys. There you go. Um. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm on mute the whole time. God. <laughs> no, no. They got a good taste Just of it. We, Just we, got, we got way more than we bargained for. Wait, did you guys <laughs> know what song I was going for? Yeah. 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 If, if you kept singing, you might get a full YouTube. I did mute you. You were being way Oh, you loud. muted me. I did. <laughs> you didn't want to get us pulled from I hate that song, right? Because there's a local Mexican restaurant here that yeah. all December long, they flood the fucking TV with commercials, and that song is playing the entire time. It's, it's absolutely annoying. On the bottom of my heart. <laughs> all right, my turn? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. All right, I need to add, I need to get add a little edge to my Christmas. So I've got like stockings, candy canes, and eating. I'm going with DMX's rendition of Rudolph oh the Red Nosed Reindeer. <laughs> what? I had, a, 
I thought maybe you would go with Last Hollis by Run DMC. No, nah, no, nah, I'm going DMX and his interpretation of Rudolph the Red Nose Reindeer. That's a good one. Now, classic. Was this, the, was this the song you were talking about that you got better? That's better than mine? It's 100% better than yours. Oh, Rest wow. in peace, DMX. Yeah, no. And I want to memorialize him as my favorite Christmas song. Says you don't listen to, to uh, uh, Pierre, okay? <laughs> <laughs> You're gonna say that's not a good song? I, I've never heard of it. It was I cool. I don't know if it's an actual song or, or just a, a social media clip. I don't know if you can just, download that song. Just by DMX. I, I can pull it up on YouTube right now. Play that yeah. shit on repeat. Um, no, no, no. Don't because then we won't get monetized for this video. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, no, if it's not really a song, we can do it. No, it's okay. You're gonna say that's not a song? DMX singing Rudolph the Red Nose Reindeer? I'm sure it's a song. Did he record? Yeah. It? Yeah, Does he do a reindeer it's voice? A it's a sleep. That's a sleeper pick. That's a good pick. It's a good pick, man. What? Sleeper it's pick. Quick ass. Sleeper okay. pick. I never thought of it. It's a good pick. All right. Last if category. I said that, if I would have said that pick, y'all would have all been roasting me right now. So let's roast me a little <laughs> yeah. more. That pick. You right. can't roast me. It's a good pick. <laughs> He can't even. He, he his whole thing is barking like a dog, not not making noises like a reindeer. I I like dogs, I like dogs, I like Christmas, I like Rudolph the Red Nosed Reindeer, and I like DMX. It's it, was record, it was recorded at Spotify Studios by DMX. Thank you, thank you, Jason, for supporting me. I'm not supporting you. I'm just saying it was a song. So he eventually Thank recorded. you, Jason, for supporting me in my in my love in my love of the DMX's uh, Again, Rudolph the Reynolds Radio. But yeah, you know, it's your pick. All right, last category, movies. I get the first pick. I'm going with the greatest Christmas movie of all time, bar none. Home Alone. Debatable. I made my <laughs> Again, a movie that could be solved with a phone call. So um, when do I pick in this round? Because this it feels like I'm picking at the end of all these rounds. You're three. picking after snap. So fourth. You pick three and then second and then first and then fifth and then fourth. Mm -hmm. <laughs> mm -hmm. <Bullshit> rig. <laughs> you wait your turn, <laughs> Mr. You Going wait your turn, off, Mr. Yeah. I'm not worried about your pick, has it? You're gonna be like Jack Frost. <laughs> <laughs> Snowball's chance in hell. Uh, well, let me cross that one off. Cross that one off. <laughs> All right, next uh, question, Jason. I, yeah, I, I, I don't care what anybody says. This is my favorite Christmas movie. Um, Elf. Mm. Nice choice, Jason. Yeah, instant classic. Movie, nice choice. It's an my mom hates Will Ferrell. Well, <laughs> I, I feel bad for your mom. because She like, hates Will Ferrell. She hates that guy. It's a classic. Oh, oh, oh that's a good, good guy. Well, I don't know if he's a good guy or not. He's a good actor. Is Leon last choice here? No, Leon got first choice. Who's got last choice? Has he? Yes, has he? Mm -hmm. Great. Yeah. So now it's snap. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, wow, Jesus. there's a lot of good Christmas movies. Debbie does Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. If I have to um how go how about we go with we'll shoot your eye out? The Christmas, Christmas story. story. Uh. I mean Huh? It's it's seriously has he watch a Christmas movie once in a while. You don't know the nineties. You don't know Christmas story? You don't know they, they play it every year on TBS and TNT. For like 24 hours straight. Chris all Christmas Eve. That's all it's on. You don't remember the rifle that he that he wanted? I just watched cartoons. I don't know. Leg, you don't remember the leg, leg lamp? Don't feel bad, Hezzy. I never little piggy eating his mashed potatoes. <laughs> Remember the kid, the kid that sticks his tongue out and it gets stuck on the pole? Flagpole? Come on. Guys, if he, has, if, he hasn't, if he hasn't connected it to the first 27 things you described, <laughs> I don't think he's getting it now. <laughs> oh, the pole. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. Now I remember the pole, the leg lamp. I, yeah. The BB gun. I remember it all now. I probably, I probably did see it. I just didn't think it was a good movie. <laughs> I probably watched Jack Frost instead. I don't know. All right, I'm going National Lampoon's Christmas Vacation. Dude, guess guess what? There's two people on this fucking panel that haven't seen that movie. What? Right. Probably three. Snap, have you seen that movie? 
Chevy Chase, what are you talking about? Of yeah. course he has. Because he, he enjoys man. fine cinema. <laughs> Listen here, I put and together Christmas quite, vacation. I put together quite the little uh the little Christmas here. Hey, 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 hey. Cool your jets. Cause this pick right here about to seal my victory. Wait, I'm up, right? Okay. Yeah, you're there's okay. one left. We okay. to Ernest, Ernest steals Christmas. <laughs> Everyone's he favorite. He doesn't know Christmas story. He doesn't know that movie. I don't. I don't. That's what. That's what's funny. You see this Christmas Christmas movie all the time on TV every year. The Polar Express. <laughs> Boom. <laughs> Boom. That's like the Fantasia of Christmas movies. I worst. am stick into that. The, the absolutely way. most overrated, overhyped movie of all time. Best the Christmas, Christmas movie. movie. The, the, the children in that in that look creepy as hell too. The like yeah. the animation. It's back when they didn't have good CGI. Yeah, that was for for it being where it That's was. That's my biggest issue with that movie. You yeah, have all of these actual actors. Just do a live action movie. It's getting a, this is horse shit. Um, getting um, a train, getting a train they, to float. They, they don't show that movie every year. Yeah, they do. <laughs> no, they they're very really careful. Every don't year. You're... No, they don't. Every year. It's so good. It's on Netflix all year long. That's all right, that movie, all right so here's what we're going to do. That, that movie was a terrible choice. But let, here's yeah. what we're going to do. We're going to recap our draft starting with you, Hezzy. So go picks one through five. Tell us what you picked. All right. <clears throat> <clears throat> so for tradition, I click I uh cookies for Santa Which for decoration, okay. hanging up lights. Which is painful. For food, I picked Tomales. Christmas song, I picked Mariah Carey. All I want for Christmas is you. And then for the best movie. Polar Express, baby. That's a lineup. That is a lineup, fellas. I am never celebrating Christmas at Hazzy's house. That is a lineup, fellas. Who? I I mean, I don't think they celebrate Christmas in San Diego anyway. What kind of Christmas (laughs) is that? (laughs) All right, Snap, you're up, Snap. Recap your draft. Present boxes. (laughs) I have them around. That was the happen. first pick you of the draft. You want to see tons? Of the the tons very of first pick of the draft, right? That was the very first pick. Of the draft. No, no, no. Sec- second pick. Second pick. Second pick. Second pick. Exactly. Present boxes all around the tree. Beautiful. <laughs> Make the house look nice, enormous. Wow, they they balled out of control. All right. Yeah, that's all fake. All right. Opening presents. Opening. What's the better than that? Boxes. Power right. pick. Yeah, super power pick. Third, <laughs> my food. Perfect roast juicy lamb. Everybody's eating the lamb. They're gonna be nice and full. Woo! That was a great hand. That was a great lamb, guys. Um, my my <laughs> song that we're all gonna sing along in English and Spanish, in case you want to learn one of the languages. Feliz Navidad by Jose Feliciano. I got I got the mute button ready. And and. <laughs> A movie that everyone will enjoy, even if this millennial Hezzy would watch it, The Christmas Story. That is a good choice, though. He's got, you know. One out of five. Yeah, one out of five ain't bad. One out I've six. never heard someone, man, I want my Christmas lamb. What are you talking about? I got, I got about three out of five. I got Feliz Navidad, the song. What are you talking about, Hezzy? Um, Christmas Story, the movie. Open in presents. Dated. Nice lamb, lamb over peppermints all day. <laughs> okay, Jason, you want to recap your draft? Oh, sure, sure. I mean, not Christmas without your Christmas tree in every house that celebrates Christmas everywhere. Mm-hmm. Uh, Love my tra- tradition Fire was hazard. uh, what fire hazard, not a plastic one. <laughs> um, my tradition was visiting Santa. Giving them your list for Christmas morning, which was the last pick, by the way. Uh, my food, Christmas cookies. Mm. Uh, tis the season on that one. 
And then um, number three, uh, my song was Last Christmas by Wham. I mean, I, I, everybody, that's coming to everybody's head, and it's like stuck in your head right now. That's the only miss on your draft. I mm. think so, too. No, and then uh, no, my, my <laughs> Christmas <laughs> movie so too. <laughs> <laughs> is uh, Elf, an instant classic. Uh, who doesn't enjoy that movie? And, and it's one of the few movies that everybody on the panel has actually seen. So, Leon, take us through your uh, ridiculous uh, Canadian Christmas. All right. <clears throat> Elf on the Shelf serves as a way to uh, torture to and keep, keep children in line. Yeah. Number two, uh, tradition will be Chris Kringle slash White Elephant. Um, hilarious what? to the person who what? ends up with a shitty gift. Um, Fishbowl party. Really, really fun. Uh, number three, food item. Christmas ham. Got to be bone in. With all the trimmings. Uh, number four, Weird. song. <laughs> well, he just got done with his fishbowl party, so he got the bone in. Chris Brown's This Christmas. So bone in. Factor. You got a bone in. Yeah. This guy's got, this guy's got <laughs> everything. He's got pedophilia in here. He's yeah. got, like, domestic violence. He's got, Chris like, Brown, This this Christmas, it's 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 an obscure enough years. song that you haven't heard it enough. Repeat factor, a million. Um, number five, best movie. Best Christmas movie of all time, um, despite the McAllisters being very negligent uh, with, with their children. Home yeah. Alone. A ban- and, and child endangerment. Yeah, but he didn't do it. He's, he's, like covered, he's covered all the felonies with his <laughs> You really yeah. have to. Yeah. <laughs> you really have to Leon say bone in with your hand. We are the loneliest <laughs> Canadian I, Christmas. I, I, hey, has he... I take back what I said earlier. I would Dave. rather spend Christmas with you than than in that that hellhole that, that Dave, Leon dude. just. This is a great time. You're, I don't know what they can do. Leon, you're going to jail, man. That's you're Christmas. That's Christmas in Canada. That's a new Christmas, Christmas tradition. Bail bonds. <laughs> Leon's like, damn, hey, bone in. <laughs> the way you said it, too, man. Relax. That's what he says to his cellmate. Oh my god. Give me that give me that ham bone in. <laughs> bone in ham. You see, you gotta have a bone in. <laughs> I'll take you guys without the bone. <laughs> RP Europe. Yeah, that is Leah, yeah, that is seriously one fucked up Christmas, man. What do you mean? That is a good time. That sounds like a great time. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, in the yard. <laughs> well, for your one hour a day. Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> all right. So here's my here's the perfect Christmas. We were I've heard what you all have said. Now here's the perfect Christmas. All right. First and foremost, we're gonna start with some stockings. <laughs> all right. A core decoration. I know everyone was wowed by snapbacks, empty <laughs> fucking boxes, but I started with I started with a more a less conventional choice, a stocking. Uh, at number two, what, the second thing was what? Oh, tradition. 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 Eating. eating. Right. I don't want to eat stupid shit like lambs and tamales. <laughs> I want to eat good classic, like, I want to eat good classic, you know, Christmas <laughs> foods, like, you know, like mashed potatoes, apple pie, you know, like good shit, not like that weird shit these guys were talking about. <laughs> number three, Food, candy canes. Now, food is a there's a plethora of options here, but I went with something core to Christmas, and that's candy canes. Now, number four, I want a little edge on my Christmas, not the edge that <laughs> the edges that we <laughs> was talking about, because those are like, I mean, those are those are super sharp. I'm talking like a little edgy, right? So I went with DMX's Rudolph the Red Nosed Reindeer. I'm telling you, it's a classic, yeah. and if you haven't listened to it, you have to. And finally, I'm gonna end with the best Christmas movie of all time. Without a doubt, it absolutely demolishes the weird parental negligence you see in Home Alone. I don't, I don't, what did you pick, Snap? Christmas story. Shoot your eye out. National Lampoon's Christmas vacation. Well, this was an easy victory. This was too easy for me. Too easy. I think I got this one in the bag. Yeah. <laughs> I want. <laughs> <laughs> you, can put, you can put that bag in one of those empty boxes laying around your house. He said, I think I got this one in the bag. <laughs> oh, my the God. Christmas bag. Your confidence is pretty impressive, though, man. It is. Like, Snap, you leave these drafts and you believe that you've done it, man. Yeah. yeah I get a lot of satisfaction you. afterwards watching the comments. I'm telling you, I get hundreds of DMs. Uh, hundreds, of DMs. hundreds, hundreds, 
Why don't you Jesus, tell man. them to actually put those comments in? in a I, will, I will. I will. Yeah, I will okay. tell everybody to comment. <laughs> Jason said he doesn't believe you. Tell them to put it in a public setting where we can all see these yeah. hundreds of comments. <laughs> They're like, wow, snap, you inspire me, brother, with your pick. <laughs> That's cute that your mom DMs you. <laughs> this is a mess. This dude, you you think we believe this? No. Not at all. Come on. All snap, right. I think we're added to the character of this whole thing tonight is that your Wi-Fi is as shitty as I've ever seen. <laughs> no, are you serious? Yeah, it's been bad the whole time. Oh. It's good though, it adds to it. So like you're super green. <laughs> it, it's it's like you no filmed way. this back when uh, Christmas story was filmed. Hey. Even right, when he man. said no way, his mouth didn't match the audio. <laughs> yeah. He was like, no way. I think all that lamb juice is getting into your router. <laughs> Too many gifts blocking your router. Yeah. Yes, all right, we got to wrap up here, guys. This is another good time. I mean, you know, I think I think it's pretty clear here that uh, Snap did not win again. So this is like he's, he's going to be all in four. Yeah, who, Pierre, who, no, I won the pet peeves. So I'm one. I'm, I'm already, I got one. No, you, so who, no, you're getting that confused. You were the pet peeve. <laughs> oh, <laughs> wait, it's the only reason wait, you were on that wait, video. Yeah, I'm interested in saying, so who won the superpowers challenge? Honestly? I don't know. It, it was like it was it was everybody but you. So like they kind of <laughs> said like <laughs> they kind of said that the three of us had really great superheroes, and they're yeah. like, uh, but there was really yeah. no vote for you, right? Except for your own. It, no, no, no. There was one lady that said that she would hire you for her kid's birthday party. <laughs> no, no, that's true. Hezzy, Hezzy, you got. I got the power of flying, power to be invisible. Power we're not, we're not, no, 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 we're not recapping this shit now. Go watch the video, Hezzy. <laughs> go watch the video. I watched it. I voted for you, Snap. Thank you. There you go. All in the way heart, but in public, he voted for me. <laughs> Listen, Snap, one thing was clear about the superheroes one, the superpowers yeah. one. You came in dead last. Okay. So I'm telling you, when the lady, when that one what? lady wrote that she would lo- she would invite you or hire you for a kid's birthday party, she that was, was like you, not not your superhero. She's just you. About you, yeah. Are you serious, yeah. dude? When you said magic, <laughs> and you, when you ended it, you when you you could do magic tricks. That was your superpower. Man. What, are you, what are you looking for, Snap? I'm looking for the comments. comment. If you can't find the comment, she probably blocked you. Yeah. <laughs> Look at him looking. Look at him. He's focused. Uh, well, kids, we got we got to wrap this up. Let Leon get back to his Canadian prison Christmas. <laughs> He's got to select. Somebody, the said, somebody said. So this consists of the Fantastic Four: Rogue, Flash, Brainiac, and Doctor Strange. If I was to say which one of those four was the best, it would be Doctor Strange, which is me. Thank you. That comment yeah, made yeah. no sense. That person was having a stroke when they wrote it. <laughs> right. Like, what is that person even talking about? <laughs> yeah. Snap. Now all of a sudden your uh, your Wi-Fi is bad. Oh no, it's bad again. Yeah, yeah. It's terrible. All right, guys. We gotta wrap up. This was fun though. I, I I love doing this with you guys, man. This is this is a lot of fun. I, I laugh so hard that I have to like decompress afterwards. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I really do. I learned a lot about you guys today too, Leon. Like you are a creep, man. Like there is no <laughs> doubt. Like there's some, there's a creepy side to you that I can't quite put my finger on. But I think you sure this is new information. You know, this is, this, wild I'm shit, so man. glad I decided to have separate hotel rooms whenever we've uh, <laughs> been. We made poor travel, Jimmy travel, travel together. Did Jimmy bunk with you last time? Yeah, he no, no complaints from Jimmy. Yeah, he he hasn't said a word since then. <laughs> <laughs> we know with Hezzy everything has to be done in the 2000s because anybody oh, yeah. in the 90s you know, Jimmy's, yeah. coming with me to, Jimmy's coming with me to Lids on Friday right and he's like he's like hey uh, is Leon coming I was like no he's like oh thank god that's what he told me he's like damn I thought we were going to hang out yeah no because he's scared man he said, yeah, he said yeah. Here, listen one thing man is, is Leon coming I was like no nah, man he's not coming he's like oh man Thank God. I don't believe it. 
And then he messaged you saying, "Hey, I wish we could have hung out." When yeah, I, yeah, yeah. Because he's afraid of you. At that he's, point. A, he's afraid of you. He's afraid yeah. I was going to tell you. He's got this nightmare still. Well, all right, all right. It's got to wrap up now, guys. So. Listen, thanks everybody for joining us. I want to thank you, Snapback God, for uh, always making this a very easy win for somebody else. Eddie, I want to thank you for adding your uh, perfect Christmas to the equation. I never knew that tamales were such a hot item on Christmas. Very hot. You know, Leon, again, thank you for uh, scaring the shit out of all of us and worrying about our well being when we're with you alone. And Jason, you did a fantastic job this evening. I know. You had a pretty thorough Christmas there. Yeah. Uh, I, I I thought I thought like head head and shoulders above snapback, head and shoulders. Oh, it it was, wasn't even a competition. It was so clear. I mean, there there was very few holes in your draft. I mean, in in uh, in snaps, we saw quite a few uh, opportunities. Yeah. We, we, With we that, invite- Leon, big fellow, take us away. Let us know in the comments who you think won, who set up the best and funnest Christmas uh, for <laughs> Jason Leon Pierce, Snap and Hezzy. We sign out, guys. Stay fit. See you, go. everybody. Peace. Brought to you by VFTV.